There was a time when there was a struggle. And the struggle was not just a struggle, but it was an armed struggle. Hello, beautiful people. You're welcome and welcome back to John Media TV. In this video, I'll be showing you some key things you need to know about government of Pinkolo, aka Tom Polo. Please watch this video till the end. And uh, if this is your first time of coming across this channel or you've been watching and you've not subscribed, please make sure you click the subscribe button written in red. This thing is free. There's no additional charges in subscribing to a particular channel. So I beg you to subscribe to our channel because in this channel, we bring you updates across the Niger Delta states. Please make sure you subscribe. And if you like our video, please make sure you click the like button and make sure you share our videos. This is a means you can promote the donation. So please, I beg you to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also follow our Facebook page. Please make sure you watch this video from start to end because we are going to learn a lot about this great man called Government Ekpenpolo. A celebration of Tompolo's birthday. According to history presented by an author named Macaulay Lekute, that there had been no trace of Easter celebration in the New Testament Bible. However, he added that some will see an intimation of it in 1 Corinthians 5 7. It celebrated, it shipped in that the Jewish Christians celebrated Passover because of Jesus, who is the true partial man. It is naturally passed into commemoration of the death and resurrection of our Lord, which today claim to be Easter feast. It marvels us, and of course, very uncalled for, if parents of this civilized time did not tell their children about the Easter. Another thing observed critically is the aspect where mothers in Baramantu Kingdom take responsibility of training their children, while the fathers put their hands to be only busy with all the things that are not profitable to the upbringing of the children. Certain things caught us so worried. Children in Brahmatu Kingdom are changing or turning themselves to become foreigners by neglecting the Ijo language. Obviously, our Ijo language is dying. The other thing is the habit of our youth going out to marry in another land or attending bride price payment ceremony, child dedication, and birthday parties. Obviously, this mentality should be divorced. The Gentiles identified the resurrection day of Christ as Sunday. Very mentally, Jesus Christ was humiliated, downcasted, brutalized, mocked, and suffered heavily. He was crucified, buried, and resurrected on the third day. His resurrection is very imperative to mankind because it is the focal point of the Christian faith. His resurrection has made us increase in our teaching learning processes, meditation, motivation, technology, purity, and sincerity. Many things we need to know that we do not know is as a result of classity or ignorance. Birthday celebration shows a time of merriment and acquiring of more knowledge about our culture. Can someone tell us the answer? I repeat, can someone tell us the answer? Pangudu budu pangudu pafea A locket with Valerio or boy Today Sunday, as we celebrate the Easter, it is also time to celebrate our own. The incubus and impeccable general of the generals of our time. The person of I ship government Ikemukolo Owezide alias Tompolo. A man who suffered for the John Nation. A man who struggled, made relentless effort to make the Ijon Nation to be recognized and honored. A man whose effort brought generative plants, township roads, Amnesty International, Maritime University, Okren Koko, and created political structures that the Ijon Nation is presently enjoying. It is the man whose struggle led to the establishment of Testopadek, NDDC, and CDC, which the government has facilitated. Tompolo Foundation and other humanitarian engagement are standing fast to join him one after to dance Egenese, Agbobuse, Origurise, Efeletese, Abose, and Ijogbe. Ah, ma, ah, ma, 
ama agada biri kro biri ashif government ipemukolo owezide aka tom polo's birthday is our birthday to sing dance eat drink and pray for him to live more many years and to do more better things at this juncture we salute our king oboro Brian the second, whose compass directs every affairs concerning the birthday. Ah, Ketekbe. Ah, Ketekbe. Ah, Gadagba. You are highly honored. Another significant figure is Mati Tonla, a main character to the success of this birthday. In fact, Brian Grammar School students salute all of you. Today, I'm not only happy that I'm in Oporoza, but I'm very happy because we are collectively celebrating one of the finest of men in our region. In the past 24, 25 years, Tompolo, you've dedicated yourself, your life for the struggle. And if you remove 25, 26 years from your age, that is 50 today, we will all realize that people only 26 or 24 when they started the agitation for a fair share of our resources in this country. How well have we used our 24, 25 years as a people? It's a story for another day. But today we are here to celebrate you because you have gone very well. You have stood for what you believed in. In the process, you've suffered torture, you've suffered mental, mental, Whatever you want to call it. You've been deprived of liberty, comfort, everything. But today, you are still standing. Today, the journey is standing because you are standing. So I collect your prayer that for everything that you've done for our people, we are grateful. I told somebody earlier today that this is my story. One wife, one child, no house. You are a great man. The people of Baramatu, can no longer claim that you are from here alone again. As far as the jurist is concerned, the village in the, the remote village in Baesa can claim that Tokolo is from Baesa. The very remote village in Port Harcourt can claim comfortably that Tokolo is from Port Harcourt. Every job community can lay claim to your name because you've impacted everybody. You will not only celebrate 50 years, you will celebrate hundred years and we all be alive to celebrate with you. Yeah. We thank you, we thank your family, we thank your wife, your daughter for keeping you very healthy and safe. Because they don't give you problems. If they give you problems, you also have problems. They are also understanding wife and understanding daughter. We celebrate you. We thank you. We thank the grammatical people and the family for standing by our brother. I'm very proud that today I'm from National Assembly. I bring you greetings. I'm proud that I am your nephew. And whatever I do, I do that to respect, believing that what you believe in is what I believe in, is what the judgment you believe in. God will bless you, bless you and bless you again, and keep you healthy, keep you very safe, so that when we see you, every time that enjoy people, we know that there is hope for our future. We know that there is going to be a destination that we will be happy that this destination was created because the flow was leading us to victory. God will bless you and bless you again. Thank you and God bless you. I didn't come here to talk about myself. I came to talk about a young man who is still very young at 50. There was a time when there was a struggle and the struggle was not just a struggle, but it was an armed struggle. There was a time when the Nigerian nation was so deaf that there is nothing you do that they listen to. Nothing you say that you listen to. And so, a young man and a few others stood up and told the Nigerian nation that we cannot, the Asian nation cannot remain the way it is. I am talking about no other person 
than the celebrants of today's event. I thank God that I'm alive to see this day. Three, four years ago, when Tabulok birthday t-shirt was to be unveiled by the Gulamatu Voice media outfit. It was like a taboo because everybody went into ID. Anybody that identifies with Tongolo was like an anathema to the Nigerian nation. However, a few people knew that this man should not be wounded and hunted down. He stands for the joint nation identity. He stands for the Niger Delta identity. He stands for the oneness and the progress of Baramatu Kingdom. If this man is hunted and wounded down, there will be a problem. Even though there were very few that never believed in the cause. Some people believe that this man must stay alive so that one day we can celebrate him. Thank God we are celebrating him now. The Kodabatu Trahina Council is so happy to identify with you. We have never despised you. We have never run away from you. It is not today that we are celebrating that we will run away from you. TP, may you live long. Amen. Amen. Pastor, may you live long. Amen. Tompono, may you live long. Amen. God has put, in, put something in your shoulders. This project is a very heavy project. Now that you are into peaceful protests, please don't look back. There is still a lot you can do. Don't endanger your life. Just stay safe. Stay alive. Because your voice and your name still keeps Baramatu and the John Nation going. Stay alive for us, Tompolo. May God bless you. We celebrate you in Jesus' name.